There are warnings tonight about a potentially deadly disease spread by mosquitoes now include more West Michigan counties. That disease, Eastern Equine Encephalitis, or EEE. Kalamazoo and Berrien counties were already in the warning area. Now the state is adding Cass, Van Buren, and Berry counties to the list, bringing the total statewide to eight. 13 on your side reporter Phil Dawson is in Middleville to explain why. The state has identified four additional cases of EEE in southwest Michigan, including two, one in Cass and one in Van Buren counties, that were fatal. That's seven human infections and three deaths since July. And here in Barry County on the Thornapple River Trail in Middleville, people are taking precautions. I feel better now. To avoid infection with eastern equine encephalitis, the State Department of Health and Human Services is advising people in eight Michigan counties to protect themselves from mosquito bites. I hadn't heard about it before, so I'll probably wear bug spray more often and be a lot more uh, conscious if I see mosquitoes nearby. Be more aware and perhaps not stay on the trail as long. And when I hear or feel the first mosquito bite, to leave. EEE is spread by infected mosquitoes. In the eight at-risk counties, the state is advising local governments to cancel outdoor activities after dusk, especially involving children, including music and sports practices. Will you restrict your after dark activity? Yes. We, we try never to come here after dark. There probably are mosquitoes in there. Absolutely. We get further along into the woods. It can be a lot of mosquitoes sometimes to the point where you want to turn around and go back. The state says animals are most likely to get infected with EEE. During their current outbreak, at least nine horses and five deer have died from the disease. And now, three humans. One is too many. We need to protect ourselves against diseases and anything that we can do to help the, help prevent it. There have been deaths from this, so I certainly am going to be cautious and tell everybody I know that it's a real thing. Wear long sleeves and long pants, spray skin and clothing with insect repellent fortified with DEET and empty all standing water from around your house. Those are all suggestions the state says will minimize your exposure to mosquito bites. They say take these precautions until the first frost kills this year's mosquito population. In Middleville, Phil Dawson, 13 on your side.